What's up YouTube? What's going on today? In this video, we're gonna go ahead and crack open these 10 packs of Lost Origins. And we're still chasing after a lot of the alternate arts. Giratina, we're looking for you, so be on the lookout because I'm coming for you, all right? So watch your dang back. Watch your back. Here we go. Crack these open. It's been a little bit since we opened Lost Origins on this channel. And I just, these, and just to let you guys know, um, these are all coming out of a sealed booster box that I have. Um, I opened up some of those already with my daughter. And this is what I had left over. So I decided, let's go ahead and crack open the rest of these packs. Chasing after the Giratina or or the Aerodactyl. Still haven't hit the Aerodactyl yet. There's a lot of cards on here in this set that I have not hit. And I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not gonna lie. So I said I've already opened some of these with my daughter and I've had terrible pull rates on this booster box. Terrible, especially for Lost Origins. Oh, did I just mess up? Did I, I, I know I said I wanted a Garatina, but this wasn't the one I wanted. And definitely not to just pop out in my face like that. But guess what? We will take it, hit number one out of 10. So far, let's go. Right, thank you, Garatina, but uh, I, want, I want the other version of you, my friend. The other version of you white code card and you know what's so strange this booster box to me just seems very very weird the packs are peeling like this they feel all weak and flimsy they do not feel like they normally do and not only that i've had like five packs already that did not have code cards in it so this is, seems like it's a busted up air pack with a lot of problems, especially with the good pull rates. And I think we've pulled this one already too. I think she's pulled this one already once on the other packs that we've opened up. Hopefully we can pull at least get a secret rare. Uh, that would be pretty nice. See, look how, look how this thing just tears open all weird like this. All of the packs have been doing that. It just seems like the packs are very, very cheap. And like cheap, they've been cheaply made. But we'll see. Let's see if in, the, in these 10, if we get some packs that don't have any code cards like I was talking about. Mitch Fortune, Sisters. Hey, Palm, Rhyhorn, Rosalia, Gumi, Meditate. And if you haven't noticed, I've been noticing this, but the prices on these booster boxes have actually been going up. Because I price match a lot, right? I look around before I buy. Uh, especially online, in stores, and I've noticed uh, a lot of places do not sell these things for a hundred dollars like they used to be. Right? They actually went up in price. I'm seeing them a little bit over a hundred bucks, like a hundred and ten dollars now. Um, I, I used to find them easily for a hundred dollars. What am I doing? Um, at the local game stores, and now the prices have started going up in my area. And I noticed that too about Chillin' Rain, Fusion Strike, all of the booster boxes have started going up. And I think we have something on this one. I thought I'd seen something earlier while I was jibber jabbering. And yes, we do. Of course, it's a Pidgeot V. Of course, it's a Pidgeot V. We can't get anything better than Pidgeot V, right? Five more packs, let's go. But I do love me some Lost Origins. I'm not gonna lie, I love Lost Origins. Um, this was, I think this was the very, when I first, so I've only been in Pokemon for a few months now, maybe three to four months. Um, and I got in right when Lost Origins, right before Lost Origins just dropped. So this was technically one of the first sets that I really opened up. And I liked it. I liked it a lot. There's a lot of hits. The, the trainer gallery is awesome. 
and can't complain about it. Cannot complain about it, even though I still haven't hit the air daco or the Garatina. The Garatina is where I want what I really want to get. That is my favorite card of this whole set. It looks so awesome. I'm not gonna lie. It's it's I can't even believe like it's that low. I, I'm not gonna say it's low in price, but in the future I believe that card is gonna just go up in value. It the, the artwork on it looks so dope. It's crazy. There's so much going on in that in that card. And I'm telling you, pull rates. Literally, I think the pull rates on this is like so far, I think I only had like maybe a total of like seven hits out of this whole booster box. And that's counting uh, what I opened off camera with my daughter, so. And nothing good at all, nothing. I think the V is the highest I've gotten so far through this whole box. Into it's been brutal, brutal. I actually have one more pack that I have. I had actually 11 packs, and it's right there on the side. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab it, and we're gonna add to this pile. No need to just keep it over there by itself, by its lonesome. It might as well just get ripped like the rest of these. So it can go with a family of cards that it came with. Growlith, C dot. Another poopy V card. This thing even looks like a booger. Looks like one of them boogers that you get when winter starts and it's cold and chilly outside like now. And you get that boogery nose, the little droopy boogie. That's what the Gudra looks like. Booger. I'm gonna call that booger from now on. Here we go. Geez, that was all jacked up. I could have swore I just counted four, but. And that was my rare. That was my rare. Jesus. This booster box was awful. Last pack right here. This is that 11th pack I, I had sitting on the side right there. So, Lost Origins, you very, really disappointed me today. Really disappointed me. Get nothing. I'm gonna look at them code cards. We're gonna look at them code cards. Let's flip them over. Let's see how many of those were literally white. But the crazy thing is, all those had their code cards. So weird. Nothing. Wow. Lost Origin. This is the worst booster box I've ever had. One black, two black, three black. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight whites and three blacks. How terrible is that, Lost Origins? Oh, oh, makes me just want to cry. But. That's all we got. We got no more Lost Origins packs right now that I'm going to open up. So if you like the video, go down below, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment down below. Have you noticed that the pull rates on Lost Origins have gone down? Because to me, it seems like it has. Let me know what's up. Have a great day. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.